you all hate these stupid creepers. You see, creepers are designed to be one of Minecraft's most dangerous creatures. So let me show you how to teach them a lesson. Of course I did. Well, in Minecraft, sometimes you need to try again. It'll take you a couple times to do something correctly. So let's respawn and take our second... Why am I in the middle of the jungle? I have a bed, and one on earth is a respawn anchor. What are you doing here, stranger? Stranger? What? Lol? No, this is my house. You guys are the strangers. Not anymore. This is our property now, and we are proceeding to take everything. This house isn't yours just because you say so? We never said it, we declared it ours. Your dumbass used a gate as a door, and you even left it open half the time. We're going to kill you now. Oh no. Nope. Oh, got it. Up. Hmm. Video game logic. Instead of demolishing it, they took it one level down. Strange, but good. But logic is that I am through with these raiders, just inviting themselves in, shooting me to death, which hurts even with iron armor. They take all your stuff, and if you kill them, they curse you in the way that if you enter a village, they conquer it. I won't take it anymore. I will show them once and for all, you don't mess with me. Pack up your things, crew. We're going off set. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Westport County Public Libraries are reopening today? That'll be the perfect place to do research on the finger radius. Let's go! Not again! Welcome to the England Library. How may we help you today? Actually, yeah, I'm looking for anything that can help me to defend myself from the pillagers. Hmm, I see. Let me check the catalog. It appears that we are out. I'll put you on the waiting list. Thanks. In the meantime, do you have any books to teach me how to fight inevitable doom? Uh, not just raiders, but how to defend myself from baddies? You may want to look at the prophecy. The prophecy? Yeah, it's just a thing for you. Here you go. Basically, it's describing the one who will save the land once and for all. Awesome. I'll take that and this audiobook. Awesome. You're all set. Thank. Welcome. Yeah, I'm riding through the area. In a car that's made of fucking bird. Hey, can you shut up? This is a library. Sorry. This is the prophecy that will bring our land to great- Oh hi! Welcome back to How to Play Minecraft, everyone! I may only have the smaller version of my house at the moment, but that is more than made up for by some exciting news I have for y'all. I've been waiting a long time for the next amazing update from Minecraft. This one gave the nether many new things, and it's finally here! Woohoo! Says you, two months after it was released to the PC. 
I told you, cameraman, this series is being written at the same time as when I have two summer classes and a job. I can't do everything at once. Alright, that's actually a good point. I'm not gonna waste any more of your time. Keep going when ready. Okay, but I have a question. Sure. How do you know this is being released two months after the update? This sentence, I'm currently saying, was added to the script on July 5th, 2020. Oh yeah. The thing is, I can see into the future. And not only that, I determined it as well. I can choose what you do and whether you succeed or not. It's all up to me. Your destiny is in my hands, but I can change it at will. I mean, just an educated guess. The first thing we're going to do is take a look at Moody Tools. A look at one of the new generated structures you can find in the game. It's very cool, but yet the first one we'll see is actually the least impressive of the two. So you can only imagine how much we're going to be blown away by what we're going to see. But before we get started, we're going to need to get started. I've been looking at this book that actually contains a prophecy. And I'd like to see who is the chosen one. I need to read this carefully. To the one, this is the prophecy that will bring our land to great protection and conquest. He who fulfill these traits will be the leader for new prosperity, and none shall pass this impenetrable gate. He who is born at the birth of the summer guides others to a treasure that he does not possess, leads a difficult crew, protects the inhabitants of Galway, Wetwank, and Sploin, never loses his determination. Finds everything needed for a higher power, hidden in the depths of a hot land, and comes forth upon the land with really bad breath. He will save us all. That's quite something, but you know, I've been thinking, am I the chosen one? It's not as crazy as it seems. You see, it says at the birth of the summer, and I was born on June 13, 2001, at the Hidden Place Hospital in Westport. That's near the start of the summer, right, 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 right. Guides others to a treasure that he does not possess. Well, I think that speaks for itself. Leads a difficult crew. Nah, there's no way. No way. That's not your cue. We went over. Why are you late? You're nothing but a. Why I tell you, heck, oh, oh your butt dear, dear, you won't stick. And you can forget about earning that raise that I promised no, to give you. Please, no, no, please, Jason. No, I am not taking this. Why no, don't fire don't fire you don't no, that's not your cue. We went over the. Besides, my dick where my crush sends nudes. Alright, which one of you put that in the script? Shut up, James. It's very funny. I've heard of two of these places. Go Away is the internal name for Go Wayville. I helped to build a wall around Wet Wing. But Sploin? Where is that? And what do you mean a higher power? I found a whole bunch of diamonds. But wait. Hidden in the depths of a hot land. That must be the nether. Screw finding the chosen one, I want to find some of that cool stuff. Grab your things, we're going to the nether. Now, my portal has been disconnected because the nether is dangerous. So we're going to take a look at the new ones. Yes, there's now an official reference to them in the game. Grum will teach us how to make good portals, and maybe these portals are a lot safer. Come on, Joe! Really? Of all the things you can name a horse, you name me Joe? What kind of name is that for a horse? Joe Mama! Ha! I always wanted to say that to you, whore! Just hop on. Um, I thought this was going to be quicker. How long are we going? Until we find a ruined portal. How long will it take? However long it takes. You know it's almost nighttime, right? Oh no! James? 
James, where am I? Oh my god, Joe, thank goodness you're alive. Where are we? I'm not sure. Some guys just put you in the truck and drove you here. You must be in civilization, though. But what about you? They didn't do anything with me, but I just ran after the truck because there was nothing else to do. It was a major struggle. Say, by truck, do you mean ambulance? I am a horse, sir. I do not possess the capabilities of such complex vocabularies. Sir, your injuries have been fixed, and you can leave momentarily as you are fully recovered. Doctor, thank you so much for saving my master. It really means a lot- Here's that. Wait. Did your horse just talk? Yes. I need to run! I need to run away! I have to go! I have to get out of here! Please, no. Let's get out of here. Hey, Joe, why is your face in the wall? Okay, I knew we were in a town because of the hospital, but... What is this place? Welcome, my friends, to our beautiful, wonderful village. Oh, thank you, sir. But where are we right now? You are exploring. We are famous for our books, fish, and exquisite hospitality. Oh my goodness, this is goodness. I just heard of exploring yesterday, and I really wanted to see what this place was about. Well, you come to the right place. We have a hotel to the right and down that way, so make yourself at home. If you'd like to try some fish, the fishermen's a few homes down. Where do you two come from? England, sir. Suburb of Westport. I see! Very good! Very good! We'll make this our primary base for when we go to the nether to find some ancient treasure. Oh wow! I heard the nether is a dangerous place, but that sounds like a very ambitious mission. Good luck to you, sir! Thank you kindly. Why did his accent change halfway through the conversation? That must be the fisherman! I like fish! And by fish, I mean ranch flavored tuna. Or sweet and spicy. With Old Bay. If it's not that, I hate it. Hello, sir. I would like to try some of your delicious fish. Of course, sir. Thanks. That was good. Good to hear. Say, have you ever heard the tale of the holy fish? That sounds epic. What's the tale? It's common knowledge around here, but I always mention it to visitors. Basically, if you catch it, the holy fish will help you with anything you need, teach you all the secrets of the universe. Amazing! Is there a book that can explain everything? There is! Ask the librarian. Have you ever seen the holy fish? I've been looking for 40 years, but I've never found him. I read the book when I was little, but I do not remember anything. I don't read the book again. The story is, these two idiots kidnapped my parents from the homeland and took them on boats here. When I became 18, those same idiots put me in this house, and I've never left since. They call me a fisherman, but I've never fished in my entire life. How awful. Those stupid idiots. I don't even know how I got all this fish. Beats me. Good night. Hello there. Can I buy a book on the holy fish? No! Okay. Just kidding. Here you go. Thanks, ma'am. But for the holy fish, it is not eating that mattered, but swimming more than anything else. He loved to, to swim, to summon the holy fish, acquire a fishing rod, go to thy river, go fishing, and say these exact words. He will help you. That's pretty cool. Now, I also brought this audiobook with me to entertain me on my travels. It's called the Ledge of, of Lance. So let's put it in the CD player. The day was June 18th, 2017. We were in a car on our way to Cumberland for the beginning of the CNO Canal. We were going to bike the whole length to Georgetown. On the way, Lance, a scout in the car, starts to take a nap. Then, 
while sleeping, he asks, Where is my teddy? And then, stuff happens. Shut up! What a good morning to do some fishing! You know, when it comes to fishing, one could say that I am the master- No, I'm- <laughs> Noise! A fish! I'm gonna put it here for now. But, how? Oh. Hello there, human. It is nice to see you. Good to see you too. I'm on mission to find the chosen one and to see what's hidden in the depths of a hot land. Oh, so you know about the prophecy. Gives my friends in England and Fluffrygo to know you as a strong candidate. But to move forward, I will show you a balloon portal. You go through it, and the nether will be like nothing before. Sounds good. Say, fish, what's the higher power? That is a tip of research. You will mind it for a long time, but it is very cool. Okay, but what's the catch? You will need to go through five volumes of living structure and go over the law of them, and watch much more of hitting the hoglins. Okay, and then learn something to go over them. Sure, now if only a raid could come this way. What do you mean? Protects the inhabitants of go away, wet wing, and spoin? How did you get to the book? You have bought it. You protected the village from economic problems? Well, I guess so. What about the land with really bad breath? Go through five boils, including the one that you started. You go about to see it. Thank you, um, holy fish. You must really be an expert on this. Let me show you the boy. You can be real. There is enough of Syria to complete the portal. Could look to you and some triple TV? Thank you most kindly. I hope to see you later. And maybe these portals are a lot safer. A lot safer. A lot safer. A lot safer. Oh, I heard that Nether's a dangerous safer. place. Safer. And James. Stupid bird outside. A lot safer. Because I killed him. $2,000 in damages. The Nether is oh, I heard dangerous. That the Nether is dangerous. dangerous. Nether is dangerous. Hey, dude, he's not wearing gold. He's what? A traitor. Oh, got to put these on. Never mind. He is a friend. Oh, I've never seen you before. We are the piglins. We come in peace. Great. Say, what happened to the pigmen? They are dead, we killed them. They killed me once. I got some gold from Gold Block that I turned to mm. nine ingots. Would you guys like some gold? gold? I see. Very fine specimen indeed. We really appreciate your beautiful donation. So, and we would like to give you something very special in return. Where? Mm -hmm. Okay. Wow. Whoa! Yeah! Let's go, baby! Oh my goodness! My roommates are gonna wonder what's going on, but that's okay! Don't worry, I'm sure you are all here. I changed crazy. Wait a minute, wait a minute! Who put the Soul Sand Highway here? In the story, the other people going to the lane with really bad breath built it. Although the real reason is that we put it here, we'll have the background in Fillmore, but we don't have to let anyone know. Okay. 
Um, you left the camera on. I see the light on. What? Oh sh! This is the greatest update ever. Wait. What's that on the rails? Sir, you are found in the valley below the Soul Sand Highway. We have brought you here and fix you up. You are now good to leave. All you have to do is provide us with some form of payment. Oh. Well, okay, here's my credit card. What on earth happened? And I'm glad I'm okay now, but. Sir, your credit card was declined. Oh, wow, I'm actually alive. Okay. Uh. I don't know where you are, so let's take a look. Are you kidding me? There's a tree to this update now? Oh my god, now I'm gonna blow up! Well, that's so what I do. So there are new types of trees in Minecraft 1.16 that you can find in the nether. It is resistant to fire. This is the first one. So let's cut it down with my apparently very strong fist. Knock down the tree. Be very afraid. Oh wow, I guess it doesn't actually blow you up. That's cool. Now it appears that we're in the valley and it's... I don't know how to get up there, so... Figured out. Oh, what's this creature? Because of the other streets. Uh, why? Will I blow up? That right. The boss will hear it and get you. My boss will blow up. EXPLOSIONS?! Wait a minute! That's it! I could use explosives to blast my way up with a tunnel! No need to travel by lava, no, 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 no need for that at all. Thank you, Strider! Pyrotechnics? Ah, yes, my old friends. My teacher boy makes us and my day is ruined. Alright, we're going to... Use TNT to get onto the mainland, so let's be careful as always. You can make funny skits with TNT. Well, okay then. Hmm. These blocks weren't affected by the explosion. Maybe if I blast them some more, they will drop as an item. That didn't work either. And there's another one! Do I use this? Who gave me this diamond pickaxe? I guess I'll go mine this now. Nice! There we go, we have finally reached the upper surface. And there's a highway I was on. I would climb up to it, but the bull has other plans. Alright, so now I can climb to the Soul Sand Highway. Very easy. Oh my! What the? What? Hey, did you guys know that Enderman now spawned in the Nether? That's pretty cool. Now, according to my calculations, okay, let me see. I should meet the Soul Sand Highway right around here. So let's get going. Hopefully, I can. Uh, let's see. Ah. Uh.
Well, it seems like the bulls are determined to make sure I don't go on the Soul Sand Highway again. Okay, I'm finding out another bull course, so... What the frick is this building? That's huge! Um, it probably wouldn't hurt to take a look inside. Mm -hmm. Welcome, enjoy your stay at the King's Grand Palace Hotel. Welcome to the King's Grand Palace Hotel. Would you like to check in? Sure. Would be nice to stay a while after my long trip today. Okay, we have one open room. You came just in time. Awesome! I am looking forward to my stay here. This hotel is much bigger than the Sploin. Ah yes, Sploin Maryland. Our dear monarch is going to invade that place someday. I'm sorry, what? Wait. I said too much. Fiddlesticks. Anyway, here's your key. Enjoy your stay at the King's Grand Palace Hotel, where our guests never want to leave. Thank you, sir. Man, this place is fantastic. That's not figurative, by the way. Literally no one has left yet. Hmm. Not too bad. <laughs> I'm gonna put some of my stuff away. I was told that there would be a furnace in the room. And considering the layout, this is where it'll logically be, so... I'll ask the clerk. Now it's so tempting to go to sleep right now after that long day and all that bullfighting and stuff. But now I have a hotel to explore. Oh, again, my room seems to lack a furnace, and I was told there would be one. Oh, yes. Sorry about that. We'll have one installed in a few days. Or if you can get the Blackstone to craft it, we'll refund your entire fee. Okay, cool. I, I'll see what I can do. Thanks. Hmm, these must be the bathrooms. Why is it always the men's room that's out of order? Okay, now, what's in this Oh! They're having a ball. Nice. Oh, and a big public TV. Let's see what they're watching. Your useless little explosion! Rubbish and cranky bang. Thomas and Percy and Glassdoor bang. God and fire. Bird bang. James. No crane has ever banged before. Well, I'm banging bird. Well, at least I don't have a small. That's pretty good. We'll be back at the hotel very soon. I'm just going to scout out my route for tomorrow. Now, I'll also like to find Blackstone in the Delta, so let's see if I can find oh, that. Oh, there you are. I've been looking for you. Uh. Oh! Holy fish! Good to see you again! But how are you here? Your water should evaporate. Blurjuk. I see you got the itch to breathe with the pickaxe I built in you. So that's how this pickaxe appeared. So this stuff is ancient debris? Yes, yes, this is a very good previous work. Give it a little bit to your calendar. You should very be walking with me. Okay. How close am I to the land with really bad breath? Double to plumbus. You still don't have to pass the bus to the river minute. A little mother of a little bit. And fly by the cliff. I'll lower the rope for the baby boy. How do you lower a rope? You're a fish. What is it? Do not question the logic of the holy fish. Be careful of the wind of the bus to the river minute. Do not open the chest in there. Whatever else. Or else what? Whatever else? The baby boy is broken. And then we'll say, Oi, you! And then, you know what they do with the lips? What do they do next? Explosions! Really? Ow. My sploin. Oh, that must be the basalt delta. Now, the actual basalt takes a long time to mine, so we're not going to focus on that for now. This must be the blackstone, right? It's black. It's stone. No, keep looking. 
JK haha lol. Thank. Welcome. Should be enough to make a furnace. Yeah, it does work. This can be used as a substitute for cobblestone in the nether. Although, I don't know why you need to do that, because... You can find cobblestone literally anywhere! So let's bring this back to the hotel. The clerk is going to be very happy. Do you have a new furnace? You bet I do. Thank you. Just place it with the kitchen appliances. You will no longer owe us a penny for tonight. Awesome, thank you so much. Alright, I have my meal, let's sit down. Excuse me, can I sit here? All the other tables are taken. Be my guest. Thank you. I'd better sleep well tonight. I have a long journey coming up. Where are you going? To the land with really bad breath. Wait, are you serious? That's the highest point in the whole kingdom. Let me guess, you found out about it from the Spoin librarians? From the England Public Library. I've seen Spoin though, it's a nice town. Yes it is. That reminds me, when I checked in, the man at the desk said your monarch is going to invade Spoin someday. What have you heard? Shit. I knew I shouldn't have said that. Oh yes, our king. He rules the entire nether on this seed. His power is absolute, and he wants to spread his influence into the overworld. There's no freedom of speech or press. No one wants to be on his bad side. I'm one of his secretaries. Which is the only reason I could afford to stay here. But I wish there was something I could do about the peasants. Who are the peasants? Well, don't tell anyone I told you this, or I will get into a lot of trouble. Our king is terrible. I only work for him for the money. He taxes the poor heavily, and he's using the money to go occupy Sploin. There's no point to it. Tomorrow he's going to start drafting people, and they'll start their training. That's why they're having a party in there. They're celebrating their last day before their military service. The war will start as soon as he kills the Chosen One. We know, I've been thinking. Am I the Chosen One? Oh. Well, that's horrible. Any chance I'll run into him during my trip? No, he's not fit enough to climb up the mountains. Proceed. Just don't insult him in public. Absolutely. And if anyone asks, this conversation did not happen. Appreciated. <laughs> We're going to watch a game. Would you like to join us? Sure! <laughs> Get ready to hit the hay. Uh. What? That's stupid. Why the furnace? No, I don't know. Okay. All right. Good night, my friends. I'd like to check out my room now. My visit was fantastic. Could I have a business card? Certainly. Here you go. Okay. Uh-huh. Wait. So you're Senor Pee Pee Poo Poo Man? Indeed. That is my name. I don't care. Okay, uh, I think I'm done here. We're done here, guys. Now, I've been looking for a bastion remnant all over, but I cannot seem to find it. But don't worry, there is a command we can use. All you have to do is type T slash locate bastion remnant, enter. I am stupid, idiot. Myself a stupid idiot. We are working on how to play Minecraft 1.16 Part 2. 
Not a YouTube poop. That comes next month. What do you think you're doing? How many times do I have to say this, James? Shut up. It's funny. Well, we're running out of storage space, so you better get going. How about maybe you get going? No, you get no. going. No, how about you get going, you little bitch? Hey, you don't forget to do a lot of in this book. I don't care. I feel great. How it feels to chew five guys and one life gun. Six bucks. Four flags. This is your wonder. Oh, it's a ruined portal. Nether edition. And there is a chest to this one. Inside, there is an Uno reverse card. This seems so strangely specific that it might actually be useful for something. Okay. We also need this called Crying Obsidian for a respawn anchor. Now before I forget, we have actually gone through the whole video so far without any gas jokes, which is unacceptable. So let me find some right now. Ah, here it is. So this is going to be my base for the time being. If I did, I will have the respawn anchor here. So that is that. I fill it up. It's easier than ever to do this now without leaving the nether. Alright, I literally have no idea how to go through these things, but I'm doing it for your edutainment. We'll fight to the death! Starting at the end of the sentence, I will be going off script. Alright, let's get going. I'm not gonna mind that gold block for now, just because that is dangerous, you know? This is dangerous, you know. Because the piglins do not like that. I. Ooh! I'm gonna be careful over there. Oh, oh look, a chest. I believe you get an advancement if you open them in the remnant. So let. Oh frick! Holy fish told me not to do that. You're coming after me. What should we do? We better kill him! We better kill him! Now supposedly, it's like a big room. A big room. Yeah, a big room. Ooh. This could be it. Like, literally. My only knowledge of th this place is from your MC Admin song for of 1.16. And it's not much. Oh no. I hear a bull. I don't see any piglins anywhere. Oh. I hear one. Ooh, there are the bulls. If you attack the hoglins, do the piglins attack? I'm not sure. Tell me in the comments down below. Because as you see uh, in the trailer, they attacked one another. I'll just kill them before they kill me. Uh-oh. Uh uh oh. Phew! Just in time. There we go. Extra bacon. Oh! Oh! <laughs> he fell! Is that a crossbow? No, I don't think so. Does light prevent them from spawning? 
Not sure. Where is everyone? Oh, just. But if you open the chest near them, uh, they go. We better kill them! If you need to kill piglins, make sure you kill the children first, so. That way there are no orphans. And literally, that happened. Uh, once again, this is not scripted. What on earth happened there? Did it drown? Oh, I see one at the corner of my eye. Ooh. Now, what else is there to do? Oh, uh, there's a pool. Big bowls require big strength. Is it safe to go down one? Okay, I think I'm fine. Oh. It's a ball! Oh no! Oh, there it is. Hey, they're attacking the bull for me! <laughs> he's, he's dancing! Dollies, sir, damage. Two thousand crazy damage. You and your friends. Ouch. That's a lot of freaking gold. Oh no, are those magma cubes? You haven't seen, but I don't like these magma cubes, man. Uh, they're always jumping all over you in the basalt deltas. It's really annoying. Uh oh. I guess that's just a sound effect, not a crossbow. Oh, the spawner! The spawner! They, they spawn! Well, not anymore. This thing isn't really as dangerous as I thought it was. Uh, it's really just don't, don't piss off the piglins and you'll be fine as long as you're okay with the bolts. Not hoglid, nether bull. Now how do we raid all this school? You want it a lot, but if we even begin to mine it, the piglins will come and kill us! So how do we do it safely? Well, it's simple. We build a wall. We build a wall to keep out all the piglins, and the piglins will pay for the wall. We are going to make Minecraft great. To okay, I'll stop. Alright, so, I call off access to the wood here. Okay, to the best of our knowledge, we can now mine in peace. Oh, yeah, they're pissed, but they cannot come in here. No way on earth. Okay then. Huh? What's this chain doing here? Where where does it go? It goes. Huh? I originally meant meant this to be a vent to like let auction come in, but where did this? I didn't put this chain. <laughs> oh, okay, guys. I, I assure you, this this there was a, some big mistake, and you guys are trying to understand. I will recharge this anchor just in case I did again. And now we go to find more ancient debris. It is an extremely rare ore found in the nether and is a main source of netherite scrap. Most common at Y equals 15. Blast resistance of 1200? So it must stay there when there's an explosion. Pyrotechnics? Oh boy, I always wanted to do this. What have we found? Ooh, yes! This works! So far, it's going great. Why didn't I think of this years ago? Because ancient debris didn't exist years ago, idiot! So let's continue with our- Oh no! I'm out of TNT! This is a disaster! 
But don't worry, I know exactly where to find some. Hey, you guys are doing great. I was just wondering, can I have more explosions? Sorry, but we can't give you explosions. Our budget for the month just ran out. We'll give you explosions next month. Well, I can't say that's your fault. In fact, if our pay has ran out, we're out of here. Goodbye. Wait, don't. So if you don't have any explosions, no more. This is how we find ancient debris. So listen up. Many peoples like to go strip mining like this. They say that this minimizes required mining, but we like to think differently in my style of exploring the nether. You see, when I mine all the way through the tunnels, I don't find no netherite. It seems like a goof idea on paper, but no. So I have a plan. We go dig deeper. No, not using the staircase. That's boring. I'm going to show you how James Schooner's mine. We mine by doing it straight down. There you go. Isn't that amazing? Let's try again. It's very fascinating. Uh oh. <laughs> Shut up, said James. It's not funny. You know what? This is what happens when you dig straight down. You're fired. The next thing we're going to do is find a place to put the netherite into the diamond. To get started on that, we will first get out of this big mountain. Ah, that's much better. Oh, hey, here's something I've been meaning to show this to you guys for a while, but it never appeared. Right here. So this right here is the second type of tree that's new to Minecraft 1.16. Unlike the crimson trees that explode when you make things out of it, warped trees like this one explode when you first knock them down. Just like that! I got some more bacon from the bastion remnant, so now that the furnace is fixed, we gon' do this. I have six- What? Why won't it go in? Well... That doesn't work. Can we make a board out of it? So, if I can't use the wood to cross the ocean, why don't I try... A pig! Okay, pig! Professor! Jump! Oh no! Well, instead we should try... Aha! Giving the pig the power of fire resistance! Hang on, I have a brilliant idea. I'll kill these things, I'll just die, and you're just straight, just swing across the ocean! Woohoo! Uh, stupid 5G cell towers. Sir, use the saddle on the strider. Um, why? Come on. Come on. He does not want to go. Okay, let's see how else I can cross the ocean. Wait. You like this? Come on, Strider! Okay. Ooh! This actually works! I am very impressed! But does that mean... Hang on! 
Okay, jump. While we go across the ocean, I have a joke to tell you guys. You see, a man walks into a bar. He says, OW! Yeah, let's just go. We're almost at the land with really bad breath. I have all my sp Oh crap! My ancient debris, it's gone! It must have dropped him when we hit that bar! Oh no, dang it, that was a really good find. Are you sure? I'll take your word for it. Oh look, there's a bar, and there it is. How do I get it? Okay. Okay, that was a close one. Thank you, Strider. I thought that was done for. I am very proud to work at a weight muscle. I mean, it's an honor to help you. Are you freaking kidding? Oh, this must be where I have to climb. Okay. You're almost at the land with really bad birth. Just a few more obstacles to go. Oh! Sounds good, fish. But be careful. This is where we store our TV. Oh. Oh no, the Strider doesn't know. I better go check on him. Okay, let me just check on him. <gasps> Strider, that is dangerous, and you know it. You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna count to three, and when I'm done, you better get back here right now. You know you're not supposed to be there. No, get out of here right now. No, Strider, no! I can't look! How will I ever save you now, Strider? Um, wasn't I on that path before? I didn't even need to go through all this silliness. Oh well, at least I got all these cool resources along the way. I probably should have reached it by now. What's going on? Oh, there he is again. Very good. You have made it to the base camp of the land with really bad birth. My best plan is working perfectly. I'm sorry, what? But I need let me get to the door for me. Okay. Ah! Ooh! <laughs> um. Hello there. I mean no harm, please do not hurt me. I have been looking for you, Triple G. I've been waiting for you right here, as I knew you were not taking the highway. Uh... If the highway had an exit here, why didn't you leave me back to it when I fell off? Um, 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 we got to go, boy. Remember the bull that kicked you off the bridge? I sent him there to throw you off, and then I deactivated your credit card to make sure you're thrown down there again. So you wouldn't be able to get back on the highway. But why would you do that? To slow you down, of course. To give me more time to prepare. Alright, get to the point where you kill And me. everything you were told about the holy fish. Well, it's wrong. He's my servant. He's a nice guy. He gave me a diamond pickaxe. What? I told him not to give you anything. I'll make sure he regrets that. I hate your land. And that's why I designed guard base camp. To make sure you never prosper. And you raided my palace, the beautiful palace of all my friends inside. You will regret that block, boy. If you live in a palace, why do you work at a campsite? Just get over here so I can make your death easy. Make me. Oh heck. Oh, oh, oh no! Uh, quick, in here. Okay, this seems like a safe place for now. I get to hide from the king here. 
Oh boy, what's this? <gasps> oh no! Well, that didn't work. In here? Your soul's head fired. It makes double damage. We should be safe now. Oh no, I can't. Everybody should. I don't burn, I am from the nether. Wait, no, my perfect plan! Ow! Uh. Nice blowing! Oh my god! Just let me go to the land! Never! That always stopped me for so long, shoo Come on, Donald Trump! I need you now more than ever! Okay, we're safe for now. It's 2020. I'm used to isolation. Alright. That's good, but we're not done yet. Wait. Why did the music stop? No. Give that to me. Give that to me. I would play Fortnite before I gave it to you. Get away from me, you evil. Oh no. My perfect plan. I need to run! I need to run away! I have to go! I have to get out of here! I have to leave now! Quick! Maybe. On the way to the land with really bad breath. There could be a bridge. And I can toss him off. Now we'll be safe! Lost us. Save. Aha! A bridge! There we go. I can toss him off. Oh. <laughs> You're trapped in the fake Soul Sand Highway, just like I planned. You have been resistant to everything I've done so far, but not for long. And I have. Explosions! No! Don't I'll have to do is ignite, and you, Jonathan, will be a goner. I will not wait. Did you just call me Jonathan? I do not go by Jonathan. Call me James, you evil. <sighs> Stop it. Stop it right now. I demand that either bow down to me or die. There's a third. I can make your death easy. Don't talk back to me like that. You monkey. Which one? The only time gas really did me any good. He did it. He killed our evil king. I had no idea that you liked that so much. You, my friend, have saved us from a horrible rule, and our tyrant is gone. Please accept our gifts. Oh, oh wow! You all are too kind. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. May you enjoy your independence. And once I celebrate with y'all, I will go home after a calm, peaceful hike to the land with really bad breath. You have made it to the land with really bad breath. Oh. protect us. I just knew you would. So that's what I had to do to get the protection exploit requirement for the prophecy. I thought I just had to buy something. 
According to the Holy Fish. The friends told us that the Holy Fish is a liar, a traitor. He's a disgrace. What a twist. The mayor has asked me to give you something as a gift for saving us from the king's attacks. Here, it's a free pass to our local amusement park. Wait, you have an amusement park here? I told you to shut up! Enjoy your breakfast, sir. Thanks. Say, is this the holy fish? Ha <laughs> ha, we thought about letting you eat him, but we could not catch him, as these two idiots have us all trapped. How awful. Those stupid idiots. Okay, Joe, almost home. We're gonna... Are you kidding me? Look, it's the chosen wannabe! <laughs> you guys seriously want to rob the most powerful player in this yeah. Minecraft world? Yes, because you're not it! The thing is, we wrote the prophecy, and I am the chosen one! No you're not! Yes, I am! Yeah, well, let's look through the requirements, shall we? Born at the birth of the summer. While you were collecting ideas for the script, you got the idea of having us in around the summer solstice. So, yep. Okay, well, guides others to a treasure you do not possess. For me, it's being good at Minecraft. For us, it's totems of undying. People come to our buildings, take them, and we don't know how to use them. Leads a difficult crew? These guys are difficult. On noobs and stupid people. Protects the inhabitants of Galway, Wetway, and Sploy. You would never do that. Yes, we do. We protect them from having peaceful lives with us around. Alright. Never loses determination. I can already see that. What about a higher power found in the depths of a hot land? We found diamonds in the desert. Ugh. Alright, I admit it. You're smarter than me. You're the better man. But you never came forth upon the land with really bad breath. It's in another. So you're not the chosen one. I'm sorry. Is this some kind of idiot joke that I'm too smart to understand? All these dummies spend a week anyway when they don't realize that they can just put dirt blocks in this formation. Oh. So we're both the chosen one. We're hmm. equal. Nope. Have you noticed that? There's a fourth page to that book? Take a look. Well, time to die. No, wait, you can't just declare yourself a chosen one. That's not how this works. Wait, don't take that book. It's a library book, you stupid waiter. Well, time to die! Alright, <sighs> now that I'm finally home. You guys want to listen to the rest of the audiobook? Alright, let, let's take a listen. And Lance, in his dream, looks for his teddy. He grabs James's water bottle and starts to cuddle it. There you are, Teddy, he said. Then, Lance wakes up and gives a confused look at what he was holding. Why am I holding your water bottle, he asks. James and his friends burst out into laughter. Hey guys, before this video is over, I just want to say thank you all so much for watching How to Play Minecraft 1.16. It was so difficult to make, but also a lot of fun. Thank you to Derek for voicing some of the characters in these parts, and to all of the artists who provide royalty-free music. That means a lot. It was very difficult balancing this and my work at college. But I'm happy to do both. This may be the last major series I make for a while, just because I really don't have the time. But 
don't worry, I still have many Minecraft things waiting for you guys, as well as Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. That's going to be my next big thing. So, there's still a lot to look forward to in the near future. If you like this video, please give it a like and leave a comment. If you want to see more, be sure to subscribe. If you want to get notifications, be sure to ring the notifications bell. This is James Shuen, aka Triple J75. And until next time, peace! Whoa. Deja vu.